I will say, because I was all through when I was, the whole conclave started, even before that we had a lot of discussions in the VIP room. Keeping all those, what has happened today, I will just share two thoughts which are prominent in my mind in the area of financial inclusion and financial literacy, which go hand in hand, many people said, and it's true. Supply side, demand side, literacy is required, otherwise product, how they will sell. They have designed the products, if the other person doesn't understand, they can dupe, they can sell, because there are many projects which has to be push sell, otherwise people will not be interested to purchase, like insurance and others, which people said. But what is occurring to me as the first thought, is I was thinking how much financially included I am in my life and how much I am a financial literate person. This I was preparing some kind of a grid for myself. You can do for yourself. The students also can think after listening to all the products and all the way the financial world has moved and is trying to move, where you are placed, you can just assess that. And everyone can assess also. I, I find I am quite included in terms of a financial inclusion. I am an included person mostly. When it comes to banking, I am more or less included, but I, didn't, I, didn't, I had the misfortune of not borrowing anything from a bank, commercial bank. Whatever little borrowings are required for a house or a car, my employer was good enough to give. I joined RBI, shifted to Nabad, so they, they provided all that. It was very hassle-free, and I got it. I have experience of associating with my driver who wanted to get a loan for an auto which he wanted to own. Of course, with him, I moved three, four commercial banks and learned for a small loan which is defined within two lakhs, what is involved in getting a credit from a PSB, which is regulated, which is, there are people who are trained there about the financial products and they must do more of credit and all that. Little less than two lakhs loan. It had, I'm not going to share the story about the banks. It had its own hassles. Even the branch manager ends up asking that the person should give three years income tax return. I said, Madam, he doesn't have income. What is the question of income tax return? What do you do now? Because the rule book says they are guided by that. These are the financial institutions. Now the institutional level I was thinking, now, in, when it comes to literacy, the way the financial products are growing and it is happening, I find my literacy level is 60%. I do, I know capital markets, some bits of it. I do not know what is margin trading, what is futures, options, this, that, and what is happening in states and all that, new products coming. Even the regulators are baffled. They are taken for a ride. They do not know what to regulate, what to regulate as. Mr. says very nicely, I was really impressed that he has, Dr. Mishra has introduced so much of compassion for the future, that future needs to be distributed. All that has happened has happened. But when you design, when you involve, you must, for a frame, short term gains quickly, as many capital gains, uh, capital markets, they end up doing allocation of resources in a dysfunctional way, that should be regulated, seen. Now, I was always finding, there is always one sentence I was, it was coming into my mind, there is more than what meets the eye. There is more than what meets the eye, always. Like someone said, credit card, they write something, the other things are written at the fourth piece. Intensely, it's more than deliberate when institutions do this. Supposing I, at the age of 59 or 60, when I was about to retire, many people came because they know I'll get money, will be flush with me. So they said, okay, sir, you do this uh, insurance, this, that, or investment, whatever. Someone came, he said, sir, you do this policy, this good. I, in a simple way, five years you invest, next five years you get like this, this is okay. I did. Now, first year I paid the premium, second year I paid the premium, third year when I interacted more with their own staff in other branch, they said, sir, because you are more prone to mortality, of course, everyone is mortal on this earth, 
They said you are already 60. So you, since you have taken a policy, your mortality charges every year is around 24,000 rupees. I said, yeah, yeah. Yes, I am more prone to mortal, mortal because I am past 60. That is true. But who will die, who will not die, it is not known. But he said, sir, if you would have taken the policy in the name of your youngest child, and you are the sponsorer, you can get a TC benefit. But your mortality charges would, be, would have been 5,000 5, rupees. Now, who will tell this? Now, these are all part of so-called law. And the IRDA has prescribed or whoever has prescribed. Now, but no one says this. Because they have so much of reluctance to tell the truth and stand by it. So what I'm saying is, the, it is OK, as I'm addressing to the students, they might not have, in terms of experience, in terms of knowledge, attending such conference, reading books, uh, some experience they have, they must be using. We, I must be using uh, ATM debit card at the age of uh, 50, they are using at the age of 20. And they will, technologically, they are so very familiar, they will quickly move into those areas. So as you move, the caution with which it needs to be seen, because the capital markets, whatever they have said, they should be careful about that. That's what I would say to the students. But nevertheless, not staying away from it should not be an option. If the world is getting more and more financially um, uh, monitored and uh, technologically driven towards that. So there is no way you cannot stay outside and really make a mark. But in this, the whole, the last thing which I would say is, one is in our life, we can be, we can be a transactional person. Transactional person, I think of my life, so someone is starting his life, yet to join a job, he said, okay, I'll join a job. Then I, what I'll do, I will, okay, now car and scooters are easily available through EMI. Earlier days, we were purchasing it uh, quite late. But now it is available, I'll purchase, then I should have a house. So transactionally, I have put 10, 15 items that it should happen in my life. As I think Mr. Mishra was saying, if you are seeing that as the, your framework and result, by the time you think of the result, the process, you have missed life itself. So if you say you to yourself, whether it is a bank manager or institution also, if they say we are transactional institution, the government has said five lakhs account to be opened, we have opened. The RBI says without KYC, we cannot open. I have done KYC, all the parameters. I have got someone filled in, or I have got a signature, I have filled in. KYC is done. No problem in audit, but if individual level, society level, institutional level, if we say we want to be a transformational person, when I say to a KYC, know your customer, can I, whatever data I collect from him, can I grow with him as a lifelong uh, participation? Because I have everything which he needs, but how to give him, how, to, how much to give, how not uh, to give, if I go give him five loans so that he dies, he cannot repay. This is not my role. So transformational role in the institutions play. At individual level, we play with our knowledge. Then we'll really make a dent. And it will be our life. If you think only transactionally, now I have a message which came to me in my mobile two, three days back. I'll not name the bank. It says, they have opened 83 million accounts. Jamdham Jojana, earlier also some Jojana was there. Every government is trying. Government has their own way of mission mode. Otherwise, things will be so slack. The institutions, the kind of elephants they are, they will not move. They will do something, so some in the meeting only, they will show this much of growth has happened, sir, in the next meeting, dekha jayega. What you can do? So the mission mode is required. So they have done. 83 lakhs accounts have been opened. Now we have technology. Even the cooperative banks have what is called highest level of core banking solutions. They are doing what commercial banks or foreign banks are doing. These people are also able to do. Now the message says, now the institution by introducing suddenly, earlier I was keeping 500 rupees, uh, whatever 4%, 3% they were giving. So the poor man was having an account. He didn't want to open the account. You have introduced at least 
interface you have made, good thing you have done through SSG or otherwise you have done. Now, because of the driving by the, the profits which are required by the organization as the first motive, and transactionally, transactionally I have done 83 lakhs million uh, accounts. Now I say, if you don't maintain 3,000 rupees minimum balance, from this date, you will, your account will be deducted by 10 rupees. Neither the person who is maintaining the account he knows, nor they have made enough efforts to do that. Now suddenly, the bank has 835 crores as a default money for them. I am not against that. If there is a default, they should collect. They should charge for SMS, everything. They, they should not die. They should be sustainable. But what efforts they have made to say to the clients, or have they graded? They could have graded also. I don't know what they would have done. But only driven by your transactional requirement, computer can do any number of transactions. They have done. Banks, by default money, by cutting that, have earned this much. They must have lost through different uh, Nirav Modi and others. So many things they must have lost. Now they will be able to show in the quarterly or annual result this much of money. Out of which, poor people, in terms of their education, their actual knowing, whatever needed, generally knowing all sorts of things is one thing. In his world, whatever little products he requires. What is the point in telling him about pension products when he doesn't have a single money to save? So, stage by stage, if that only at the individual level, if a person thinks transformationally, then the, from the top people, if they think my organization will work transformationally, not transactionally, I think will make much more difference in the life, so that what Kailas was saying, that we'll be able to distribute the future in a more equitous way. Thank you.